Joey Chestnut here. Right here I have 210 pieces of sushi. I made the sushi into the Olympic rings. And uh, I'm celebrating the Olympics. Thanking Japan for hosting the Olympics this year. I'm eating sushi for the first time in any kind of challenge capacity. And my goal tonight is to eat 200 pieces of sushi. Let's get it on. Three, two, one, eat. Casualty. Man down. Guys, this is a lot harder than I thought it'd be. All right. So much rice. Girls, eaters, this is hard. A lot harder than I thought it'd be. Still tasty. It's scary though, eating a lot and then still thinking I ate a lot and then it doesn't even look like I put a dent in it. It's, uh, it's a little bit scary. But uh, I'm gonna keep going. There's a joke, competitive eaters. Like, we always say like, oh, you can never get full off of sushi. And I, uh, <laughs> like everybody you go to a sushi restaurant, oh, if you uh, eat sushi, you're, you need to have a second dinner like two hours later. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna need a second dinner after this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna finish these rings. The perimeter is gonna be hard, but these rings are going down. Black ring is down. Two more rings to go. And big rings too. Oh, so much room. My body's never eaten this much sushi at one time, so it's uh, it's taking a little bit of convincing. I have rice in places in my mouth I didn't know existed. one of the hardest challenges I've ever done or even tried. I'm gonna finish these rings no matter what. I'm pretty one piece of sushi. The rings are done. You guys think I should try to go? Keep going. Pieces of sushi down. Got a little leftover extras for uh, my family. But I, uh, dude, I pushed hard. I uh, celebrated the Olympics and I ate all of them with chopsticks. My hands are actually tired. But uh, thank, thank you so much, everybody, for watching. And uh, let me know what you want to see next.